you want me to do Javita Light? I mean, this is not 2020. I don't do Javita Light anymore. That was 2020. I'm a serious news network now. I don't, I don't do things, scars for, you know, views. It's scars for views is 2020. It's middle pandemic. Uh, you know, anything for a laugh, you know, very depressed. Uh, you know, I, I, I haven't seen the numbers from yesterday's Javita's shows, but, oh, wait, here they are. Those were our numbers yesterday's for Javita's Lace shows. Those were our ratings for yesterday's Javita Late reruns. Okay, I guess I will do some scars. <laughs> and this is Javita Late. <laughs> Uh, the EIDL grant is back, and so is Javita Late. You know, uh, you haven't got your grant, you haven't got your loan, your loan increase has not come through, you've waited for the grants. It's just sort of like 2020 all over again. Only thing is that this scarf is sort of strange and itchy, and you know, it is summer. Uh, well, at least summer here in LA. But, you know, the good thing about Javita Late is, you know, if you never like what she says, you just cover it up, and, you know. Um, but now that the Temple of Doom is gone and Javita Lay's back, can you imagine? What would Sir Loin say and, you know, what would he say about the whole situation? <clears throat>so I was at the casino last night and you know um I was trying to enjoy my $12 ice cream and um I was saving my seat with some scarves <laughs> Sir Lloyd did not like seeing some scarves there he walked up he said like, what are those things doing why, why are there scarves there I want to talk about fourth stimulus monthly stimulus checks $1,400 $2,000 a month I, I want to talk about more moolah I mean you got to say that in the first 10 seconds of the video otherwise no one knows what the video's about uh, you know you need to talk about stimulus right at the top LA put up some numbers put up some numbers right away I mean this is how Sorloin does it we talk about big numbers right off the bat and then we talk about $12 ice cream later on <laughs> You know, oh, there's the moolah, L.A. Late. There it is. Put up the moolah. Yeah, I, I got it, Sir Lloyd. I mean, there, there's the moolah. They, they've seen this graphic before. Yes, but look at that moolah. How many Cowalax can I buy with all that? Well, I, you know, Cowalax is sort of expensive <laughs> this day and age, even though you use Cowalax. Uh, uh, you know, but yeah, they've seen this graphic, Sir Lloyd. But keep the graphic up, L.A. Late. No, they've seen this graphic, L.A. Sir, Sir Lloyd. Well, you know, why are there scarves where I sit here at the Calcino uh, LA Late? Are you talking to Javita Late again? Yeah, I, she just made an appearance on Evenings LA Late. I mean, viewers want her back. and <gasps> You can't bring back Javita Late, sir, LA Late. Sir Loin is the, is the core of the show. Javita Late's 2020. I'm 2021. You cannot bring back Javita Late. I mean, what are you going to do next to me? Bring back Blaine 66 from Tier 2? Well, yeah, I've actually invited him back to the show as well. You cannot do this, L.A. Late. You know, we're talking about moolah for stimulus, monthly stimulus checks, $2,000, $1,400. If you're on SSI or SSDI, are you doing my work? You know, this is my show. Why are you doing my lines? It's not supposed to be covering stimulus. It's supposed to be covering cows. Why, why are you covering stimulus? Well, so, you know, L.A. Late, this is... You cannot bring back Blaine 66. Well, what's the big issue about bringing back Blaine 66? First, it's Jovita Lake. Well, EIDL Grant is big, Sir Lloyd. I mean, people are getting the invite now for the remainder of their $10,000 EIDL Grant. And, you know, Jovita Lake's moving the goalposts again. It's sort of like wearing scarves to the beach in the summer. Nothing makes sense with Jovita. Uh, that people who, you know, applied for the EIDL Grant in July are getting invites before the February people. It doesn't make any sense. Well, who cares? I'm a cow. Does anything make sense? I'm, you're talking to a cow. I mean, and you're making a video about talking to a cow. Does that make sense? No, <laughs> no, it doesn't. Uh, but anything for me. Well, LA Late, I mean, Javita Late and Sir Lloyd, I mean, that's just, you know, 
she's not a cow, so she'll never live up to me. But to bring back Blaine 66, what's the big issue with Blaine 66 or Lloyd? I mean, Blaine 66 is just, you know, he was sort of an add on to tier two. It wasn't called Blaine 66, it was called tier two. Why do you not like Blaine 66, Sir Lloyd, so much? You don't remember? Yeah, no. He ate a cow rib on camera, LLA. <gasps> Sorry, Sir Lloyd. He ate a cow rib on Sir. He ate my cousin off. But he did not eat your cousin. He was just eating the rib, you know, from, you know, McRib or something. It's McDonald's. It's not really, really ribs. It's just sort of faux ribs. Oh, you saying that there's fake cows out there? That you do business with fake cows? No, I'm not doing fake business with fake cows. Well, that's just sort of like, you know, people who don't qualify for that. You know, the EIDL, you have to be on the low income base. Are you doing my lines again? <laughs> The EIDL, you have to be in the low end base, base income community to get the invite. And then you, you then they open it to up everyone else. You know, I've watched your old EIDL videos, LA, like when you, when Blaine 66 talked to the, uh, the, the, the guy with the stripper. I get to, to see you watch Blaine 66. And why would you be, you know, nervous about bringing him back into the mix of the show? You would even consider bringing him back in? Well, Sir Lloyd, I mean, can we can we move on? <laughs> cow humor. Not funny. You're not cow. Uh, well, let's move on, Sir Lloyd. Uh, today, the, the white, just a few days ago, Chuck Schumer released this video, Sir Lloyd. Did you see this video? I No, I did not see this video. Uh, Chuck Schumer released this new video about why we need stimulus. Oh, we do need stimulus. And the video is explaining the virtues of going to grandma's house. Grandma's house? Oh, Grandma Sirloin? Ah, uh, yes, I go to Grandma Sirloin's house all the time. Well, yeah, I don't want to know about Grandma Sirloin, but tell me what you think about this video. He's talking about the virtues of having uh, the four stimulus package pass because we need electronics, uh, electric stops along the way to recharge our Cadillac. Wait a second, sir. LA late. I do not drive an electric car. I drive a Cadillac. Uh, yeah, but don't they sell? Electric Cowalacs also? No, they do not sell Cowalacs. Well, what does the Cowalac run on? It's electric, right? It, it would help from the four stimulus. No, it runs on milk. <laughs> it runs on milk? Yeah, it runs on milk. It's a Cowalac. Did you see the new um, the new Mercedes on Evenings LA before this? At 5 o'clock Pacific Standard, 8, 8 o'clock Eastern. Are you plugging your shoe? I am plugging my shoe. <laughs> Did you just see the new Mercedes Benz? It's electric. It's delicious. Look how beautiful that is. <gasps> that is beautiful. I need more moon off of that. But it doesn't run on milk. Who cares if it doesn't run on milk? I wouldn't. <laughs> it doesn't start with the letters M-O either. I mean, <laughs> it's Mo Mercedes. It's a Mercedes. Uh, did, you, did you not know the cow cows own Mercedes? It's No, it's not owned by cows. It's owned by Mercedes, Daimler. No, it's owned by Mercedes. Well, let's go back to that Chuck Schumer video before you lose me too much, sir, line. Chuck Schumer said the virtues of the forced stimulus package needs to get passed because he wants to see the grandma's house. <laughs> Let's listen in to see what Sir, uh, what Grandma Sirloin would think. And give me your reaction, Sirloin, to this video. Uh, who lives in rural Illinois, will they be able to get there? And uh, we have to answer all those questions, yes. And I think the plan we're working on together uh, does that. That's right. You know, this is one of the reasons why it's so important to have the electric vehicle charging infrastructure that this country needs, especially as the cost of these cars keeps coming down, uh, you know. Cars coming down. I paid a lot for my cow a lot. What do you mean? I did what? What class of car? I'm the, the cow class. <laughs> What's he talking about? What class of car? Well, depending on what class of vehicle you're talking about. We're talking about the cow a lot class. The, the, the class. The cows are in a class of their own, Secretary. We're already getting close to the point where it's a savings for a customer when you consider that you're not going to have to buy uh, all that gas for all those years to, to buy an electric vehicle. But you got to know it's going to be able to get you to where you're going. Now, these new vehicles, I think a lot of us, maybe our, uh, our imagination about these things starts with the original electric vehicle most of us might know, which is a golf cart. Well, that's just so silly. I mean, I'm a cow. I know that cars don't, I know that electric cars don't look like golf courts and golf carts anymore. I mean, even cows know that. Uh, we're talking about some of the highest performing cars on the market now. They're coming out with all wheel drive. They're coming out with pickup trucks. Uh, so they're really meeting consumers where we are. Uh, and they're getting longer and longer range, but you got to. 
range. <gasps> more on the range. Oh, that sounds wonderful. <laughs> late. We can go more on the range with the cow. Uh, with the, uh, the, the the cows can go more on the range with the new for stimulus. No, that's no not range. Yes, he said go. We can go range. We can go herd. The herd needs to go more on the range. No, he's talking about range of driving the. Kawala, Kaw, Kaw, Mozini, Mozini, or whatever that word is you said. Not, 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 haven't you heard about this? Don't be playing cow humor with me, you LA. <clears throat> uh, let's listen more to what Leader Schumer had to say. Make sure we've got the chargers for them. And uh, as you know, the president has promised on his campaign to massively expand the uh, uh, EV charging network that we have around the country so that you never have to think twice about whether you're going to be able to get to where you're going, even if it's a long road trip. Well, I'm a cow. I never think of where I'm going. <clears throat> this is, doesn't make sense. LA, LA I'm, a, I'm a cow, cows. I'm sort of loin. I don't really think about where I'm going. I just sort of wander. I roam. I'm cows roam. I mean, here the secretary's talking about preparing a trip. I'm just, cows just roam. Why, how would this stimulus package help us? <laughs> well, you know, uh, you know, you go to the cow casino every night. Well, yeah. And then, you know, you go to Grandma Sirloin's house. Well, yeah. So, the, you know, the electric vehicle would help you, Sir Lloyd. I mean, it would, it would help you <laughs> not roam too far. Uh, yeah, 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 maybe so. Let me, let me leave some more to what he has to say. Yeah, and I was really gratified, Mayor, that the president adopted the Clean Cars for America proposal that I had proposed a year ago, and it's gotten amazing support. And it has a lot of ramifications that affect all of us as Americans. Not only do we, um, not only do we, Ramifications. <laughs> Did he say ram? We do not like rams. We do bulls. <laughs> what, Sir Lloyd? Well, I mean, cows and bulls, that's, you know, the, 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 that's how they interact. But rams? No, 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 no. We do not like ramifications of anything. We like bullifications of stuff, not ramifications. Uh, Sir Lloyd, just, you know. Uh, meantime, the President of the United States released another video yesterday from his education or energy secretary. Don't lose your energy on this one, Sir Lloyd. I want to see your comments on that, but that's coming up in a second. Let's see more about what Leader Schumer has to say. Um, and uh, provide the charging stations everywhere, one, one by your home and then across the roads into America. Um, but it's going to keep America preeminent as the number one electric vehicle producer in, a, in, the, in the world. We've always been the leading car manufacturer in the world, and we've lost some ground in recent years. The Chinese and some other companies are, are deeply subsidizing their electric vehicle manufacturing. And if we just sit on our hands, we're going to find as the world moves to electric. There, he said it. He said, move. I told you he was a cow, L.A. Light. That's, what, Sir Lloyd? I, Leader Schumer just said, if we move to electric vehicles, we are more prepared. Uh, L.A. Light, it's Leader Schumer is not a cow. He said, move. Move to electric vehicles. <laughs> He's a cow. Like Mooch, like Mnuchin, like McConnell. Uh, <laughs> They're not all cows, Sir Lloyd. They are cows. <laughs> you, just, you, you just don't know. And they drive Mercedes as well. You just, they don't. They drive Mercedes. You mean the new electric one? Should I show you that new electric Mercedes again? <gasps> L.A. Late, I'm going to have to buy more stimulus to buy, to afford this Mercedes. <gasps> oh, L.A. Late, I love that new Mercedes. That Mercedes is delicious. You have to stop eating twelve dollar ice cream to afford this thing, Sir Lloyd. It is delicious, L.A. Late. It just you know, it just it just says Sir Lloyd. Well, it probably does speak this back to you as well. I mean, it's an electric car. Probably self drives as self roams as well. And it's not funny, LA. That's dog. That's how cow humor as well. Again, uh, coming up is that new video from the White House. And Sir Lloyd, I want to hear your opinion on this new video from the Energy Secretary. Save your energy for this one, Sir Lloyd. But in the meantime, here is a little bit about the community page. Uh, not funny, LA. Community page, and they <laughs> they have the volunteers that can help you find your moolah um, from your city, state, and counties across the board. If you can't find it, I'll be back in 60 seconds with you, Sir Lloyd. You're not going to roam on me. No, I'm not going to roam on me. I'll be back in 60 seconds. If you want money right now, not five days from now, and not five weeks from now, then reach out to the community page. The volunteers can help you find that money for rent and utilities. That's at news.la.com forward slash community. The community page features a series of volunteers who are viewers like you. They can help you find rent, utilities, SNAP, food benefits, 
mortgage assistance, and help you with eviction moratorium questions as well. Their Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram individuals reach out to them and indicate the city and state you're from, and they'll get back to you shortly. That's a community page. Volunteers working for you, viewers helping one another. Stay with LA for more. Join LA Late Daily for the excitement of the new LA Late Live Daily. The excitement starts on mornings LA Late at 9 a.m. Home LA Late returns at 11 a.m. daily. And then afternoons LA Late at 1 p.m. Join us daily as the excitement continues live from Santa Monica on LA Late. And the excitement continues right, right now on Evenings LA Late. I'm back with Sirloin. Javina Late has left the um, room. She's uh, at TJ Maxx buying some two for one scarves. Uh, Blaine 66 may be returning uh, relatively soon. So <laughs> if you've not subscribed, make sure you subscribe. Also, like this video. Let's try to do two, 3,000 likes. I know that someone's going to say a thumbs down. Who are these people? Why is he doing cow humor? I just want to know where my stimulus check is. I don't need cow humor. <laughs> I just know there's going to be someone. I don't understand what's going on. Uh, if you're new viewers to this channel, I I'm introducing you to Sirloin and uh, Javita Late. Javita Late is the patient saint of messing up your EIDL. And Sirloin is the is the a lobbyist for the cows. We first met him in late 2020. Hello, how are you? And um, he is the guy who got stimulus, <laughs> that's how he calls it, uh, to go to the cow casino with his cow -lac to have a cappuccino, $12 ice cream, before anyone else. And um, tonight I'm getting his his input and his reaction to new videos from the White House about your fourth stimulus. Uh, Sir Lowen, what do you think about this video? Ooh, ooh, who's she? She's your energy secretary. She's part of a new video released from the White House today about the jobs plan. Ooh. For the cows? I, I don't know. Let's just listen in. Tell me your opinion, Sir Lloyd. Is the biggest investment in America since World War II. My name's Jennifer Granholm. I am head of the Federal Department of Energy, and I want to address some of the myths that are out there about the American Jobs Plan. Uh, she's head of the Department of Energy? Yes, she is. Wow. And she has a lot of energy, doesn't she? <laughs> Uh, yeah, she does, sir. <laughs> I, mean, I guess to be head of the Department of Energy, you have to have a lot of energy, and she does. <laughs> uh, yeah, let's see some more of that. Infrastructure is only roads, bridges, and highways. No way. It's roads, it's bridges, it's highways, but it's also airports, seaports, trains, and broadband, of course. I like how she did the uh, uh, hand gesture to show you what a train was. Can we see that again, Alan? Like, yeah, I'll, I'll show it to you again. And She's like, does a hand gesture to show you what a train is. Of course, was. infrastructure is so broad and it creates all kinds of jobs in all pockets of America. We have to choose between improving the economy and addressing climate change. We can do both. There is a $23 trillion global market for the products that are going to reduce greenhouse gas emissions out there. Who's going to be making those products? Where are they going to go? Well, we could do nothing, or we could say we as a country are going to corner the market on a number of these products to put our people to work. Who is that person talking to her? I have no idea. <laughs> is that, is that uh, McConnell? I, no, it's not McConnell. It sounds like a female voice. Well, why is she not on camera? Uh, that's sort of the style of their video. Oh. Ooh. Bills go up for middle class Americans. That is such a myth. The clean energy solutions, like energy efficiency in appliances. Do you notice anything strange about this video, Ellie? I, I No. What? What? It's very dark. It's like no one paid the electric bill. <laughs> I didn't notice that. Yeah, look like there's no electricity on in this video. 
<laughs> Your rights are aligned. It's this is the Secretary of Energy who has a lot of energy and there's no electricity on in this video. I did not notice that. Look, there's no lights on. They, they, she opened the curtain so she got some natural light. Is that how you run the Department of Energy? There's no light bulbs on? I, I don't know. I don't know her. It's a light. <laughs> notice there's literally no lights and she's in this dark room. I'm not the Department of Energy. That's how we save energy is we keep the lights off. Uh, yeah, I, I guess that's what they do at the Department of Energy, Sir Line. Let's listen to more. That is such a myth. The clean energy solutions, like energy efficiency in appliances, save consumers massive amounts of money. The average family saves about $320 a year just by installing energy efficient appliances. That, to me, is the best kind of savings. If you want to learn. Well, she's not right, LLA. Why do you say that? The best type of way to save on energy is not energy type appliances. What's more energy efficient, Sirloin, than an energy efficient appliance? Rolling out in the river as a cow. That's how you clean stuff. You just roll in the river. Uh, yeah, it's not, not everyone wants to go out and roll in the river to clean themselves, Sirloin. Uh, why are you looking at me like that? <laughs> Because that's not very funny, LA. That's what cows do. Okay. Well, I really appreciate your insights, Sir Lloyd, to today's uh, videos from the White House. Um, they, you know, Nancy Pelosi. Oh, LLA, don't put that video up. Uh, sorry, Sir Lloyd. Uh, <laughs> that um, uh, Nancy Pelosi is preparing to do reconciliation, I heard, uh, and forced stimulus could be hitting, I heard. And uh, you say heard a lot, don't you? I, yeah, I'm a part of the herd. Have you heard? Uh, yeah, so she's preparing for the reconciliation process to start, and that would put the monthly stimulus checks in there. $1,400. Put up the graphic again, LA. Yeah, I'm, I'm getting to it, so <laughs> What are you, my director? Uh, you put up the graphic again, LA. I'm getting to it, so Lloyd. Lord, uh, move out of the way. Uh, <laughs> if you uh, got forced stimulus, this is the money you would get under the forced stimulus package. Wow, LA late. That's just deliciousness. That's just delicious. That's better than $12 ice cream. It is sirloin. <laughs> so uh, ultimately, if you can lobby for a sirloin to help us get this stimulus out the door, it would really help because I know you always have your inside with the cows. I mean, congressional leaders. Uh, so if you can, as the chief lobbyist for the cows, if you could do your part, I would really appreciate it. Also, sirloin, what a, would you join me tomorrow again for another show? <gasps> I'd love to but so long as Blaine Six Six is not here, well, yeah, uh, I'll I'll promise for now I will not bring back Blaine Six Six. Yeah, Ooh, about what about Javita Lay? No, I okay. So long as I don't have to see her or her scars or smell her, uh, then I'm good. <laughs> <laughs> well, that'd be good to see you tomorrow, Sir Lloyd. So thank you for joining me, Sir Lloyd. And I thank also Javita Light for wherever she is, or she's at TJ Maxx now, uh, for joining me earlier on this broadcast. Uh, thank you for joining me. And join me tomorrow morning for Early Mornings LA, which is at 4 o'clock a.m. Pacific Standard Time, 10 o'clock, no, <laughs> 7 a.m. Eastern Standard Time, as Early Mornings LA kicks up its feet or coughs. Not funny. Uh, and I will see you there. If you've not subscribed, make sure you subscribe. Also, like this video and consider becoming a member of Purple Hawk, Purple Power, or Calcino VIP. Yes, you said that very well, did you? Stay informed, stay focused, and stay valid.